Michael Bay. This evening, uh, after uh, an enforced week off last week, Connie Matilda, uh, big critics, uh, are on just after six o'clock. I've just seen this from Kevin in Shoreditch. This is on the subject of live albums, but... Uh, and this is a different take on can you hear yourself on a live album? Uh, and no, we haven't. I don't think we've found anyone yet who can actually lay true claim to this particular fame. Uh, but Kevin says if you listen to Public Service Broadcasting's Live at Brixton album, track 12, Lit Up, there's a gig goer who clearly knows what's about to be played by the very first synth pad. The synth pad. He screams and then yells out, Thank you! I'm really glad the band left that in on the recording because it puts a massive smile on my face every time, says Kevin, who adds, P.S. And surely this person must be a Six Music listener. Do try to get them on air. This one's for anyone who's ever drunk too much rum punch. time uh, to bring Philip to your airways this evening, but you know, we must, must try at some point. But Kevin said, you've got to try and find out who the, who the person is who can be heard clearly saying thank you uh, on the public service broadcasting album, the Live at Brixton album. And, and well, Kevin in Shoreditch just got this which says hi steve i've just been contacted by some friends that said you're uh, asking to find out who said thank you at the start of the live lit up at brixton academy and it's me says philip it's me uh, lit up is still my favorite public service broadcasting track i was somehow classed as their first fan going back to 2010 there were seven of us in the audience Gone on to acknowledge me on in the liner notes of the War Room and the Race for Space. Oh. Philip, number one fan. Thank you very much, Philip, for getting in touch. There, you're right. You were right, Kevin. There's a six music listener. 